Hey what's up guys the boss here welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and today we're gonna have some tactical gameplay going on inside of Guns of Boom. Now the difference between my usual videos and this video is that um, in my normal videos I just go in there and I rather let me lead by a by my instinct so that's how I get all of those incredible kill streaks. but this time I tried to talk a little bit more about my thought progresses behind it why I'm making a certain kind of decision and how that helps me to actually control the whole match which I'm trying to always do of course and which is important to really dominate the match so um, to really tell you or show you what this is all about I think we should hop straight into the match and see on which map we're gonna play and then I'm gonna talk a little bit more about it so the map we're gonna play on is going to be Paradise Island very interesting map perfectly to show uh, some thought progresses behind it and uh, seems like we're starting uh, with all opponents at the, uh, with all members here in this match at the same time which is pretty nice so in that way um, you can get already or I can get always my first overview about uh, the map structure how our opponents team is attacking and all that kind of stuff so this is a very important point if I mess up here in the beginning then then uh, I'm gonna have a problem but yeah let's see all right wow wow against all of them but anyways they all are coming now from this side so let's switch up lanes retreat a little bit and see what we can do right here Alright, seems like they switched lanes as well, that's interesting. But I was not trying to focus all of them at the same time, because um, I would have died immediately. And this guy got pretty lucky. Seems like we're having there someone, and this guy over there is pretty annoying. Alright, finally got him. Somebody coming from the back, and this guy is taking us out. This is pretty unfortunate, so we didn't have anyone on the left lane. I should have considered that, but yeah nothing too much to worry about we're short into the match and could take out some opponents already so uh, let's make an aggressive push right here this guy camping interesting this guy camping as well somebody coming from the back interesting and that's how we control it so the problem in this match overall is that those opponents always have the time to flank us from the left side we're all in the center which is kind of a problem of team playing right here that's why I'm often getting taken out from the back which I don't personally like taking the grenade and somebody should come out from there I saw someone somewhere then there was no one coming And now we are having also the left lane, so somebody covering our back, which is nice, but somebody coming from the front lane. Alright, taking this guy out as well. Quick reaction right here. And I retreat a little bit, because I have the feeling the left lane is again open, so that's why uh, let's get back here. And we have somebody coming, like I expected. It's so it feels like the opponents uh, have kind of the success always coming from the left lane that's why they're repeating that progress all the time wow and that was the unstoppable here unfortunately the annihilator took us out but you could see already that I'm basically trying to read the opponent's moves right here um, and basically predict from which side they're gonna come so this time they're all coming from this side which is I uh, should have switched weapons quicker there and this guy what is it yeah he's probably again there yeah like predicted and I missed there this shot so that's the problem here inside of this match they constantly uh, come there from all sides I need to control the center although all of my teammates should be there Somehow they don't manage it really to control the center, which is a problem, so... Oh, what a lucky guy. And somebody over there. Let's be a little bit more aggressive, seems like this guy is there with an assault rifle. Take, got taken out. So this time we're now on the front line. Let's be a little bit sneaky and wait here for our opponent to come, alright. Maybe now we can... They're on the right side. Kill 
was a little bit too slow here again and we could see again somebody flanking right there oh man getting flanked from two sides here so this is the problem again when uh, when everybody is running straight into the center nonetheless we had 20 kills could do here some decent amount of damage um, so I also try to always uh, bring some variety into my gameplay not always stay stuck to one side because then the opponents know that I'm always there and can adjust to it and yeah overall I hope uh, you could already get kind of an impression of how my my thought progresses are right there but let's hop into another match and see if that's going the same way or maybe we're uh, performing a little bit better um, because I'm, I, I was a little bit rusty in there, like weapon switching was not that kind of fast like I hoped for. And this time we're gonna play again on King of the Hill, so perfect time to play from the other side. What a lucky day for me. And uh, yeah, let's wait for our opponents to come and let's decline this game five, request. Four, and three, four, five, two, two one, one, go. Alright, this time we're gonna start here on this side, so let's see. Probably somebody rushing straight into the center. No, then there is somebody coming from there, coming close. All right, nice. We got this point, and seems like we can hold the center. Ah, there is somebody coming. Somebody coming as well from this side. Alright, let's retreat here a little bit. We are low on health, so what I'm trying to do right now is again build up my um, armory with uh, some sniping here and the effect of the jockey. That's why I'm staying a little bit back because I don't want to have, I don't want to die obviously. Somebody over there. Alright, seems like we're about to take back our full armory. There was somebody behind that thing. Oh, that was a nice head uh, shot from this guy. So my plan to uh, replenish on my my armory was not that successful. So we gotta try again with that. Unstoppable, all right. And I feel like we gotta switch up lanes because now our opponents know where we are. That's not what I want, of course. So let's do that. Feels like we're actually doing quite well. And actually this guy was not aiming at anyone in the center but at me, that was unfortunate. So we got stopped here with the unstoppable. And now we can of course, uh, since nobody is really trying to flank, we can be a little bit more aggressive here. Seems like our, uh, our teammates are doing a great job cleaning up here, the, the opponent's team. That I survived that, that was a miracle. Sorry teammate, couldn't be of that much help in that situation. Let's reload everything and... Yeah, that was a little bit too much again, but anyways, we were on the front line again and I felt like retreating from that position was again not the smartest decision. And we are starting off again from this side, maybe we can flank a little bit or move a little bit further. And we're fighting against two against one. Of course the Thanatos could help out here again, but we won the um, shotgun battle. Hmm, I think we, we gotta be a little bit move our uh, attacking lane a little bit forward because we have that one dangerous sniper over there. We gotta take care of alright, somebody coming from over there. Alright, now we are a little bit further in front, nobody can attack us really from the left side. And we take care of the right side, alright. Yeah, that seems like a good sp position to take care of them. And that's of course again the win, this time 15 kills and 5 assists. And I hope you kind of got the idea how I'm trying to pick my positions. So basically I'm always trying to be reactive, sometimes proactive. Sometimes I try to uh, retreat a little bit to build up my armory, of course, again, so that I can continue my kill streak. And these are so just a few insights. Of course, uh, it's easier to talk about uh, incredible gameplays when you're not playing right now to really 
uh, get in detail all my thought progresses down but if you want me to do that definitely drop a like as well on this video and I hope you enjoyed it that's gonna do it peace out